I'm cursed. Cursed with the gift of perception. Everyone wears their lives on their sleeves. I can read it and know everything I need to. What's the point of seeing if there's nothing to look at? What's your story? Dark makeup, ripped clothes, black jeans, high school. Rebellious, strict father, pushover mother, wants to prove she's not like her parents. Everyone is so predictable. Morning, Brian. You the only one here again? I am. Okay, well, have fun. Jen said she probably won't come in again today, so we're on our own. I'll be back there. Same as always. Preppy smile, flashy bracelet, expensive shoes, but no ring. Rich parents grew up getting everything she wanted. I think she always will. Blouse and skirt, rushed and overworked, college professor. Give me a hard one. Lawyer, no kids, Aaron, wants me to think he's important. Music student. Final thesis in composition. Farmer. Country music. Once, Kenny Chesney. I hate people. You taking lunch too? Great, it's my 15. Oh, what was that? My neck does that sometimes. I should really see a chiropractor. God, don't you hate people? Uh, what? <laughs> people, man. People suck. I don't know how you manage to keep a straight face all the time with all the strangers that come through. I'm much happier in my little corner. Uh, no kidding. <laughs> what you got there? Peanut butter and banana? Uh, yep. But I know it's weird. Nah, I take it. My mom used to put peanut butter on bacon all the time. May I? Bet you're having a harder time reading me now, huh? Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Don't try and hide it. I see you out there, watching everyone, looking at all their physical cues the way you do to judge them. Uh, how could you possibly know that? Come on, Brian, it's written all over your face. You have this look. I'm better because I know more than you. I wonder if you actually do. No, I get bored. Reading people passes the time. So being bored gives you clearance, then? To make someone up to be exactly how you think of them? That's shallow, Brian. It's a shallow if I'm always right. Are you? Or maybe you just judge everyone at surface level and don't know anything about them. I don't think that's true. Okay. Go ahead. Tell me what you see when you read me. Well, your makeup isn't as detailed as other days, so you most likely didn't have time. Did you sleep in? No. Eye bags. That means you had a late night. No wedding ring, and you dress like you're single, so the late night was probably with a guy. Way to point out my eye bags there. All right. How does you noticing details tell you who I am? People aren't that complicated, really. 
You can tell who someone is by impressions nine times out of ten. Is that so? You have a cheap shirt, old aftershave. It's clear by your hair and fingernails you don't really care about how you look. Wouldn't that make you a 20-something college dropout? Forced to work a job you hate because you can't connect with people well enough to find a career you actually enjoy? What do you like anyway, besides being bored? Duh, I, duh, I don't like being bored. Mm-hmm. Brian, you really need to connect with people and give them a chance. If you take everyone at face value, then you will always be stuck. Uh, why are you saying this? Felt like it. Feels good to be judged, huh? D I'm sorry. Maybe if you gave people a chance, they might actually like you. <laughs> might even go out with you sometime. That you believe that? Oh, I, uh, I, I, see, I see. My 15 are up. I'll see you back out there, Brian.